One, two, three, legacy! Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. You guys see it? Good morning, Vogue. This is Adesua. Welcome to my home in Accra, Ghana. So, on a typical day, I usually wake up around 6 o'clock before the sun gets too hot. I like to meditate out here. I start my day by preparing by just clearing my palate, like clearing my body. So you basically we just become like a Jedi. You know, like it doesn't matter how much chaos is around you, you're focused, you're laser visioned. I took a break from modeling. I had decided that enough was enough. When you're the it model, you're working 10 times more than your predecessors because there's that much more demand for things to buy. It came a point when I needed to take a break and um, somehow I ended up in Ghana and then just every time I get a chance to escape, I run back here. <laughs> it's bliss. <laughs> Come on. So right now I'm gonna make some breakfast, some scrambled eggs and some coffee. My dad taught me how to cook, actually. But I can only cook like Thai and Nigerian food. If you ask me to make spaghetti, I'll probably burn your house. Okay, I actually did burn these ones. We're about to have breakfast, and after this, get ready and then go out into the city. I don't have any forks. So life in Ghana is quite hot, so I haven't really got a lot of clothes. We've got this Free to Youth daily paper collaboration. Two streetwear brands, one's from Amsterdam and one's from Ghana. This one is a bootleg. I thought it was really tight, all the eyeballs. Dungaroos. It's really fun to wear these. I'm probably gonna go with this one because it looks pretty hot today. So now get out of my room. Let me get ready. Go, 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 go. Okay. Oh. Let's go, let's go, let's go. To the art market. Okay, guys. Independent Square stands for freedom and justice. Okay, so we are on our way to the first location of the day, which is Art Center. This place is one of my favorites because you get to find like a lot of old antiques from all over Africa. You can find anything and they can make you anything you want. I chose the word legacy to be the name of my brand because it's about the very statement of forward ever, backwards never. It's actually about me providing a space where everybody comes together and support. One of our biggest problems is communication. If there's one thing that we have and this is the best, it is art. It doesn't matter where you're from, it doesn't matter what language you are. When you see art, it speaks to you because it speaks to the heart. Sure. Uh, <laughs> 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 Literally find the most amazing art here. <laughs> Hello, how are you? Hello. They're really, really big into, into the arts in Ghana. They have a festival called Chalewote. That's a street festival. Like it's like African, like hippie kind of vibes. It's really, really cool. Welcome to Art Center, meet my guys. My guys, say what's up. Show them, yeah. <laughs> they make everything in here. Look yeah. at all the beadwork. There's all different kinds of woodwork, yeah. there's mud. What's that instrument that I bought with? Galimba? Yeah, Galimba, yeah, 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 yeah. yeah exactly. This is how we met, because we couldn't agree on the price for three days. Yeah, for three days. <laughs> <laughs> okay. See you later. Bye bye. Anytime, you know. I'm taking you guys to one of my favorite places in Accra. It's called Sky Beach. <laughs> We're gonna go check out my art installation. I'm making a nine feet tall woman on a mountain. So I have Queen Idia, right? Nine feet tall, right? And then her body is just this basket and it's made by an artisan. So someone made a basket, someone got the pole, someone made the head, someone got the flowers, carried up a mountain. Quinidia was amazing. She was one of the first queens to go to war with her son. In a space where women aren't considered equal as men, it's really, really like a big deal who she was. Check it out. Welcome to my crib, welcome to my crib, Osikai Rock Beach. Welcome to Osikai Beach, my favorite place in Accra. You guys see it? Where's my baby? She's right over there. 
So her head is Queen Edia. She's about nine feet tall. And what we're gonna do is cover her whole body with flowers that are found around town. And just to have her as a symbol of regeneration. So these guys were born and raised here and they helped me build her and carry her up there. We carried everything by hand. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Come on. Be careful though. My lady. I chose this spot because it felt right to me. It felt right that the queen would be sitting here. It's this hidden little like entrance into this beach, into this world. It's really peaceful here. Okay, come with me as we try some new foods. A lot of the restaurants really mix art with the food, so the spaces are really, really cool. Here you see like a lot of like Afro-futuristic art uh, surrounding us. It feels like, I don't know, like you're in a museum. Thank you. I haven't cooked, I haven't cooked in three years until COVID hit. Then I had the time to even start making my own food, uh, my own simple eggs. <laughs> really good. So many flavors that your tongue has yet to experience, you know? A lot of the foods are like traditionally old, old like recipes from way back when, you know? Just got my certificate of incorporation. See that? Legacy Pan Africa LTD. We're official. Ow, ow, ow. So tight. <laughs> Today, you guys got to check out a mini glimpse of life uh, off modeling for me in Ghana. I think that there's so much more to, to discover and to learn about Ghana, Ghanaians, and Africa as a whole. I'm just excited for all of that. And yeah, I can't wait for you guys to see all the wonderful work we've been doing here. Thank you so much for spending the day with me. Um, I hope you guys do come by. I hope you guys, um, yeah, hope you guys come and check out Ghana. It's really sick. Peace. Hello Vogue, this is Adesua. To watch more videos like this, subscribe here.